Man, is it good to see a striker of this caliber make the walk to the UFC octagon tonight. Really decorated on the feet, and no surprise, he's definitely interested, Joe, in keeping this fight standing. We'll see if he can put on a striking clinic tonight. Takedown defense will be a weapon of use if he can keep the fight upright. Scary for the opposition tonight. This guy is one of the toughest guys we've ever seen compete in the octagon. His ability to overcome adversity, to absorb punishment, and then come back to deliver his own is a really amazing thing to watch. So as this young fighter makes the walk, you gotta think he's thinking strategically about how to get this fight to the ground to set up his guard passing abilities. Great technique, plus athlete as well, and really a guy who cuts the guard with the best of them to set up a dominant position on the ground. I think a lot of opponents are sort of freaked out by just how quickly this guy transitions between positions on the ground. No doubt his opponent has prepared. Sometimes you just can't simulate an athlete like this in training. This guy has some of the best defense I've ever seen inside the octagon, and they say that defense is the best offense. Our tale of the tape for this highly anticipated welterweight fight. Four years, the difference in age between these two fighters, with some differences in height and a similar reach. And with the official introductions, here is the veteran voice of the Octagon, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge of the Octagon, Mario Yamasaki. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live! from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC walkerweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a boxer, holding a professional record of 11 wins, one loss. He stands six feet three inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Tom Reeves! And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet ten inches tall, weighing in at 168 pounds. Fighting out of backpack color, Russia Assassin! All right, I gave instructions to you guys in the locker room. I want you guys to follow my orders at all times. Defend yourself at all times. Touch gloves. All right, here we go. I am fired up for this fight. It's been a long time coming, and they're finally going to get after it. Here you go, first one. You ready? Are you ready? Let's go. Here we go. Just out of range with that left hook. Opens with the left hand and lands flush. Opens with the inside leg kick. Splits the guard, connects with the punch there, Joe. Almost in range with the straight left, but that's a miss. He's got a beautiful leg kick. Oh, effective use of the jab by Breeze. Caught him with a punch. Missed that shot. Faints with the punch. Oh, nice strike landed there by Breeze. Well, Joe, I know he's an offensive fighter, but he's gonna have to figure some things out here defensively, moving forward and right into the straight punch there of his opponent. Nice jab by Breeze. Really missed with that right hand. Three minutes remain in the round. 
such good movement in there. He's looking to land the right just out of range. Good exchanges from both fighters. Missed the mark. Slightly deflected. Oh, and he tags him with the straight. Nice job there by Breeze. Big punch. Able to check that kick as well. Unable to connect with the right. And oh, he lands a right hand. Him. Nice. Hard straight punch. Nice leg kick. Try to establish that jab. Under a minute to go in the round. Forty-five seconds to go here in round one. He's got good accuracy on that jab. Trying to find a hole for that right hand. Big straight left. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Second round, straight ahead. Great work. You won that last round. This round, you want to keep mixing things up. Use your punches, use your knees, use your kicks. I want to see you work that. And here's a nice punch that lands clean. And here's another punch that sneaks through. And here's another perfectly placed punch. Brittany Palmer in the building tonight. All right, round two. All right, so here we go. Second round is underway. Pretty good first round, Joe. Crowd seemed to like it. Not the greatest round you'll ever see, but good high-level action on both sides. Both fighters had their moments. We'll see, though, here in round two if there is less of a feeling out process and more of an uptick in the aggression here. Round two underway. Oh, big shot! He's gotten hurt here. Big Beautiful body, body shot. shot there, too. This fight is dangerously close to being stopped. Oh, huge head kick. Looking to land the right hand, he misses. Blocks the shot. Well, the offense has been there. He is landing some good shots, but not really stringing them together and putting combinations on his opponent. He's got to mix up his strikes, change his tempo a little bit, and try to get his opponent out of there by landing more than just one strike at a time. So a much different approach for him here in this second round. He was a little bit tentative in round one, a little bit of a feeling out process. Now he has clearly found his rhythm, found the range. We'll see if he can continue with more activity here in round two. Well, it's one thing to have length. It's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Breeze. Just missed on the overhand left. Good head movement there. Under two minutes now to go in round two. Straight punch lands to the body again, Joe. He hasn't made the adjustments defensively. The body is wide open, and the opponent continues to attack what is a very vulnerable area tonight. Showing the punch. Punch coming, it's blocked. Just misses with the right. And the 
front kick is there. Nice job by Breeze. Right hand upstairs. Well, straight right hand has been a good weapon for him. He misses with it there. And he lands it to the leg. Unable to connect with the right hand there. 20 seconds to go round two. Throwing that jab, no good. He landed that punch flush. All right, that's the end of round number two. And here's a nice shot, lands perfectly. And here's another clean shot that lands. And another perfectly placed strike. Incredible striking on display in that round. Put the pressure on this guy. Ariani Celeste on hand as usual. Definitely gonna want to start this round off fast to try to pick up where he left off. His opponent was in big trouble at the end of that round. Oh, he just continues to land with a high volume of strikes here. Not unlike the previous round, Joe, and at least if his body language is any indication, he is not slowing down whatsoever. Breeze gets caught with that punch. Gotta shore up the defense here. See the total strikes? Just out of the range with that right hand. <laughs> Trying to establish that jab once again. Inside leg kick. Oh, you gotta like the output here. So aggressive with the strikes, he continues to light him up. Gotta be careful here not to gas out, of course, but you gotta like the offense we're seeing from him, especially in this round. One to the body. Head off the center line, slips the punch. And he's looking for that left. Kick lands. Oh, nice slip to avoid that right hand. Well, you've got to admire the urgency here. He is trying to keep the judges out of it, lighten up his opponent left and right. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. With two minutes and change to go in round three. Again, going back to the jab just out of range. Breeze gets touched by that leg kick attempt. Just out of range with that right hand. And the kick lands. Didn't quite connect. Ooh. Going orthodox now. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. 45 seconds remain in the round. Oh, misses with the jab. Oh! Breeze gets caught by that straight punch. That'll get his attention. Oh, and he ate a front kick. All right, there's the clap for 10 seconds to go. And that'll do it. 15 minutes in the books. Let's see some of the action here. And here's another clean shot that lands. And another perfectly placed strike. Very impressive striking going on in that round. Everything you worked on is working, baby. 
Ariane Celeste is holding it down. Four fight scheduled for five five-minute rounds. So far, phenomenal performance that we're so privileged to be able to watch. Well, he has landed some good shots tonight, Joe, but as yet, he has been unable to string together any solid combinations, and that has served to keep his opponent in this fight. So let's see if he can change up the tempo a little bit with his strikes and try to put together a combination that is more damaging to his opponent. How about that chin? Oh, and he lands another strike to the body. Not a ton of real estate there, but he certainly found it. Constantly a moving target. Good combination so far from both men. Going to the body there with the right kick. Throwing that jab yet again out of range. Nice. Looking to avoid that left hand. Oh, nice hook there by Breeze. Switching stances here. Under three minutes now to go in the round. Effective strike there by Breeze. Oh, slips to avoid the right. to the body, Joe, and he has shown an increased susceptibility to that strike here tonight. Huge kick to the leg. Very nice leg kick. They're going at it now. Strong defense here as the hook to the head is dropped. Oh! Big knee! This could be it! There's a nice inside leg kick. Just out of range with the straight left hand. Oh! 20 minutes oh! down. Stop. Potentially five to go. Here's a big leg kick. Here's a nasty head kick that lands. Here's a perfectly placed leg kick. We've really got a chance to see some awesome action in that round. The OG Ariane Celeste in the building with us tonight. He's got a strong jab. Miss with it there, though, Joe. Total strikes. Man, looks like he's trying to set records here, landing all of these strikes. He is aggressive to a fault and really has been all night long as he continues to pour it on. Got to be careful here, though, not to gas out. He's blocking almost all these shots. Trying to kick the leg out.
Keeps going back to that jab, keeps throwing that jab, but unable to land. Hook to the head, lands flush there by Breeze. Well, you didn't see a lot of the body work from him in the earlier rounds, but he's certainly getting after it here. Big shot to the body connects there. We'll see if he can follow it up. Nice punch there by Breeze. Back to the jab now, no good. So clock starting to become a factor here. Really swung everything into that kick, but fell short. Two minutes and counting to go in this fight. How about that chin? A huge kick for the knockout victory. Well, yeah, Joe, you want to talk about execution, and he just couldn't have done it any better than that. He is known for his kicks, and that was just a perfectly placed in time kick. Full force, landed flush, full extension with the leg, and you knew that if his opponent didn't get the guard up, that was going to be the end of the night, and he went good night. And let's get a better look at it from a different angle. So there he is as the celebration continues. A huge knockout for him here tonight. 